comes from injury is a big part of the offense. Both teams like to throw to the tight end a lot. That's out wide, and Nico Collins almost broke free. Haskins went in motion out of the backfield. Patterson on target. Patterson, all kinds of time to throw. Going deep, man open. Giles Jackson inside the 10, first and goal, Michigan. Kind of ran the wheel route down the sideline. Excellent protection. Enabled Patterson to let that play develop. And Jackson kind of snuck out of the backfield. And Moore has the goal to go defense for Indiana. Back corner and a touchdown for Ronnie Bell, his first of the season. <laughs> First two catches of his career last year. Well, they got the good matchup they wanted. He's working on a safety, Jawan Burgess. He's turned out a top five defense year after year after year. Usually better than top five. Ramsey hit as he throws. It's a wobbler, and it is an interception for Daxton Hill. Recruited Daxton Hill, the brother of Justice Hill, former Oklahoma State star, now running back with the Baltimore Ravens. Quarterback coach will have to the interception. Here's Michigan. Hassan Haskins around the corner. It's a passion for him. Dave Womack is the defensive coordinator now. Nathaniel Snyder's kickoff returned by Giles Jackson. Peyton Ramsey is 8 out of 10. Deep throw again on target. Tariq Black down at the 35-yard line of Indiana. The pistol now with the freshman Zach Charbonnet, the running back. He's out of Southern California, demonstrating his ability. First down inside the 15 to the 12-yard line. 23 yards on the run for Michigan. Again, watch this center, how athletic he is. Good blocking on the edge by the tight end of the tackle, but the center gets the middle linebacker, does not allow Raquan Jones to scrape outside to make the play. Down by seven. Nearly four minutes into the second quarter. Patterson to the end zone. And what a catch by Donovan Peoples-Jones. To the wide side of the field. Throw that ball up high. Let Peoples-Jones go for it. That's good coverage. I mean, you're not going to be in better position in coverage than Taiwan Mullen was. But it was a perfect throw and a high point catch. Here. The sophomore gets the call. And He's back to the line of scrimmage, and that's it. Defense. Third and ten for IU. And that percentage is going to get even better. Aiden Hutchinson. And it's a stunt inside. Here's Hutchinson. He's going to stunt to the outside, and he's going to be the guy that collapses the pocket. Two guys go in. He loops to the outside. Ramsey has to try to scramble. Up front. Shea Patterson doesn't have to focus on any of that. To the fade, Patterson on target. Here's Nico Collins. Really nice combination. They're going to clear out and just watch the middle open up. They clear out on both sides. Collins works into the middle. Given plenty of time again. End zone, and it is caught by Nico Collins for the touchdown. And overthrow Nico Collins. He knows he's a big receiver, has a size matchup. Throw it up there and let him go high point it. Ramsey handed it off in the jet sweep motion, and Josh Uche just dumped Donovan Hale. Through the gap. Here he is right here. He's just going to come right across the line of scrimmage and meet the ball carrier. There's nobody there to block him. And two. Bill Hart's on the punt. And well done. He's an excellent punter. They bring pressure. Patterson has time, has an open receiver, and has a big play. They've been a, doing a nice job of getting the matchups they want. When they get these receivers on safeties, that's where Patterson's going with the football. The group came up here. Here's Hassan Haskins on the shotgun direct snap. They convert on fourth down. Notes <laughs> that we both received in the mail. Picking over my shoulder. Ramsey is wrapped up, and they do take him all the way to the turf. Another play action pass, another bullet to Nico Collins. 
They're trying to get him. Raheem Lane will not catch him. Touchdown, Michigan. One of them's just kind of going to sit, and the other one's going to run the slant right behind him. Beautiful throw and timing by Patterson. A bad angle by Jawan Burgess. Number one. They're going to go for two, and Indiana defended that very poorly. It's for Peyton Ramsey. And look out, he gets hit, and the ball's out. Hit from behind, and the ball popped out. Josh Uche got there to jar it free, and Michigan has recovered. His shoulders turned right away. Watch him take a beeline to the quarterback Bedford's beat right now. Strips it, pushes the quarterback away from the ball, and then falls on it for the recovery. Did it all on that play. And there he can really rush the passer, and he has some power. He can go speed to power. Patterson back to the end zone. Another touchdown pass. His fifth of the game. So Collins is the furthest one out. Here he is right here. He's just going to run the post. He's going to come right into the middle of the frame for Sean Shea Patterson. He goes up high. That's You know the other thing about that throw, Sean? He throws it up high. Three receivers in that bunch to the right. That's where Ramsey looks. Throws it to the back pylon. And incomplete. You got a bunch formation. You got to sort it out if you're the defensive backs. And Mattel is in perfect position. I mean, there's just nowhere to put this football. Third down and four. Patterson deep again, adding to what is already a huge day. My seventh catch of the season. He's out of Everett, Massachusetts. See, Sainer still stays on the numbers, which allows the quarterback to throw that to the sideline, out over the outside shoulder. That's impossible for Reese Taylor to defend. Connor Thomas getting his first touches of this season. So Michigan has now won 24 straight head-to-head -head against Indiana and 39 of the last 40. And they didn't need overtime to do it here in Bloomington today.